Hi guys, welcome back to Crafting with Kay. Today, I'm gonna do another video on how I border my ball caps. I basically picked up this cap from Walmart. They were a dollar. They were regular $3.97, but I got a bunch of them for a dollar. So, I'm gonna go ahead and border my initials on this cap. So, let's go right ahead and jump into this video. So, what you would need is, of course, your hoop. I'm using a four by seven hoop. I'm using tearaway stabilizer, and I'm gonna be using my um, spray bond. And you will also need some um, stick pins to hold down the hat on the stabilizer. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna float my cap on top of my stabilizer. Okay, so what I did was I lined up the, the seam of the ball cap to the hoop where the arrows are on the hoop right here. And I basically just put some um, stick pins to lay this part down flat. And when you see this start stitching, you're going to see me hold the fabric down, lay it out um, to kind of make sure that everything is flushed and flat and the design comes out nice and beautiful on the cap. So let's go ahead and jump onto the, um, the embroidery machine. I'm using a metallic gold thread. This is the way I do it. Everyone has their own different method and way of um, stitching on a ball cap. So, but if you like me, you improvise and you make it happen. So let's jump right into it. So, okay guys, here's how it came out. I have some jump stitch and I did notice that this hat had a little stain right there. Um, it's for me, so I don't really care. And it was a dollar hat, so I would just wipe it off. Um, like I said, it's um, tear away, so you can just pull it back. bend the hat a little bit it's perfectly centered I'm gonna go ahead and get my scissors and I'm gonna cut the jump stitch okay guys I really really like the way it came out I'm really loving the metallic on the white and yeah I'm loving everything about this hat and I'm happy I did it for you guys so if you like this video please remember to like and subscribe and until next time, bye guys.